I'm Kay Stewart. I'm an investment advisor representative and founder of Stewart Advisory. I like to see people achieve. I like to see success, whether that is someone who's working with me or if it's a client. I, I think my role uh, as a developer is extremely important. We are fully focused on the client number one um, and the business after that. We're willing to help out the people just starting. Uh, they may not make a lot of money for the firm, but we want to see them succeed. We want to see the people who have a will and a want to start saving uh, get where they need to go. Everybody's experience with every individual in this office will be a little bit different because it will be tailored to what they need. Our first questions will be more probing. What really is your goal? What do you really need? Uh, the first meeting in here will be trying to figure out where you are where you want to go, what you've set yourself up for now, what you have in place, and then us helping you plan to get where you want to be. The environment that I've tried to create where we are supportive of one another and not in competition with one another, that we bring all skills to the table so that we can help our clients is more than likely very different from other environments that I've been in. It's not cutthroat here. I found I loved what I did uh, I love the job, I love working with people, helping people. Uh, I wasn't able to do it exactly how I wanted to. Uh, it had a different focus than I had. So I met Kay, uh, who started the business. Uh, she, she and I talked for quite some time and ended up deciding this was a much better personality fit for me. And uh, I think I finally found a firm that I'm comfortable being at. My experiences with financial advisors hadn't been very positive in the past. And I did have some trepidation about coming to work for a financial advisor. I interviewed with Kay Stewart and um, uh, through her, the interview I could, st I could tell that this was a little bit different than my perception of most financial advisors. That this was a person who was really much more interested in helping the people and developing plans for for the clients than she was in making you know her own dollars. When I came to interview with Kay and Clint, um, just their whole way of thinking is different. Their whole way of putting the clients first and taking care of people more than their bottom line. That makes a difference. One of the questions that I ask someone when they come in the door is what is important to you and it does not have to relate to finances. In answering that question, and I, uh, which probably takes 10, 15 minutes of time if there's two people, I can pinpoint exactly what they think their issues are and probably what types of solutions we may have to work toward. I, I think when anyone comes in here the thing we really want to know is everything we can about them. Uh, we want to know their risk tolerance, we want to know what they're comfortable with, what they're not comfortable with. I, I tell a lot of people it doesn't matter how old you are, the rule of thumb, it doesn't apply to everyone. If you are 30 years old and only feel comfortable with very safe things, that's what you should be doing. It's not worth losing sleep at night uh, just to take a little bit more risk because that's what's appropriate for your age group. There's a large misconception out there with financial advisors that I need, you need to have $250,000 before you come see a financial advisor. Well, if you just graduated from college, you could just have your first job. How are you going to get to that $250,000 minimum without going to see a financial advisor? So no matter where you are on that path, come talk to somebody. Come talk to one of us. Let us help you. That's what we're here for. Our desire here is to have the willingness to help anyone who wants help. I want them to see us as being dependable, that we do what we say we're going to do. I want them to see us being ethical. I also would like for them to understand that we are competent in what we do. Our loyalty is to people, not the corporate world. We listen to learn about people's dreams and hopes. We are willing to change. We are willing to um, develop and, and do what we need to do to meet the client's needs.